My name is Travis Hunter. We're here in Eureka, California on Humboldt Bay on our 80-foot uh, trawling vessel Fishwish. I'm a fourth generation fisherman. This vessel crabs and fishes ground fish, Dover sole, sable fish, thorny heads, rock fish, lingcod. As with everything, you know, there's more regulations, which there did need to be some regulation. It, it started out with having quotas. About 10 years ago, the trawl fishery entered into a catch shares program. With that came additional regulations such as 100% observer coverage. That either means a human observer or cameras. And it just, it adds expense and inefficiencies, which isn't quite so bad when, when you're able to make money and, and things are good, especially now with the COVID-19 restaurants being closed, which is a huge part of our market where our end product goes. Yes, the boats are still working, operating, but covering expenses and costs is extremely difficult right now. And it's pretty scary not knowing when this is gonna end. But we were seeing this a year ago, before the pandemic started, there were concerns in the, in the bottom trawl industry, marketing issues. One of those being farmed imports. We're having to compete with, we, we've got a, a good comeback story to tell here, and I just don't think it's been told yet. It can be done without, you know, a mudslinging campaign against, you know, tilapia and, and exports and stuff. But I mean, I think consumers' tastes have, have changed, which is why it's probably even more important to promote our own domestically wild-caught seafood. I was born and raised in Eureka. I didn't have much of a choice being in the uh, fishing industry. It was a fun, challenging job where a guy can work hard and, and do well. With the coronavirus pandemic, it's extremely difficult right now.